Now I will play the last match on WWE Mayhem Story Mode, the Viper Pit Chapter Title Shot Episode. I will face Randy Orton, who seems stronger, with two of my superstars, Roman Reigns and XPAC. Roman Reigns is headed to Sunna Slam on August the 17th for a showdown with Randy Orton. The Viper has had heat with the former Shield Strongman, and the two men have been battling it out in one confrontation after another on WWE programming. And while some fans may view this as just another feud to perhaps keep both men distracted from the WWE World Heavyweight Championship, the truth is that it's much more than that. This feud is about Orton helping Reigns to build his WWE legacy. The speculation on Reigns for quite some time has been that he is WWE's next top guy, the heir apparent to John Cena. It's a notion that began as something just blowing in the breeze among the wrestling community. However, it soon gained traction as Reigns began to emerge as the crowd is here tonight. Shield, the most dominant faction in Ooh, WWE. Smart move. Well, he, he's he's taking it downtown. We know what's coming. Gang in the company. Going to back to Slack. Magnificent. He's not strength. going to. Is he? Oh, oh, okay. I think we have the best in the house. Fans believed he would be. So when the guy oh, in trouble. To this back, he's in trouble. Reigns was finally given Where his own. I've never and seen anything like this. Full advantage of. Oh, now, he's taking him downtown. Oh, too too much pain for WWE one man. World Championship oh, he's in danger of being pinned. Match, I know I saw it. Money in the left, you're not going to be defeated in the Fatal Four Way match at Battleground. In both instances, Reigns fit right in with WWE's heavy hitters, and that includes Senna. And while many fans were likely hoping that Reigns would reach the top in one of these bouts, the fact is that it may be too soon for him to do so. It could very well be that he needs some more time and some more wins against quality opponents. Enter Orton, who has been in the top three most featured superstars in WWE over the past several years. Fans are very accustomed to seeing the Viper performing on that level, and to see him now step up to Reigns is something that many of them surely expected to happen. And yet, Reigns needs wins over quality opponents. To be placed into the main event spotlight because he's supposed to be or because fans want to see him there is just not enough. Reigns must turn everything he gets in the company and part of it comes from working Orton in this rivalry. It's the only way to up his value, to increase his standing with the fans that are paying to see him in the ring. At the end of the day, Reigns can talk a good fight but he must back it up. Facing off against Orton is perhaps the best way WWE can make that happen right now. Senna is distracted with Brock Lesnar and Kane has once again removed his mask on Monday. Ah, uh, here we go! What may be the best choice left to help Reigns at this point? Oh no, not again! Leg drop! Nobody gets up from that! Look at this! Oh wait, he's not, go he's not going to, is he? Bam! He just unloaded on him! Oh yes! Nobody is a match for this superstar's technique. Oh, that was brutal. Ah, he's barely holding on. Ah, he's going for a submission. Submitted. Astonishing. Thank <laughs> you.